What's up folks, Sid Corpse here, and welcome back to the wonderful world of Pixelmon. And we're here, we're back in the desert, for several reasons. One, we need glass. So we need sand. Um, lots of sand. And the other thing is, is I want a Q-bone. I really, 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 really want a Q-bone. And I... Yeah, really want a Cubone. So, Cubone is one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, in in usefulness and you know just general overall. Uh, I mean, they're kick ass. Especially, we're gonna want one for our catching team. Um, now, I'm pretty sure I'm in the right area. Cubones need to spawn... Uh, yeah. Want to spawn around water in the desert. So, areas where there's water and... Like this here. This this area here. It's, it's one of the desert subtypes. And I can't remember exactly what it's called, but... Oh, this is going to take a while... And that's all I brought for sticks? Ooh, yeah, okay. We're not going to get quite as much, um... Quite as much as I thought, then. But, we got to look around. Yes, I want more cactus, too. Flygon... Um... But we're going to need glass. I kind of finished off the roof. Um, the house is ready to be basically finished. We need glass to put in the... In the windows. And I'm debating whether or not to do colored glass. Um, I'm thinking light gray, but that by itself presents a few problems. Um, what is that? A Dunsparce. Okay. Um. Ours is a nice cave. Um, we would need... Oh, God. We would need, um... Bones and... Let's see. Let's see if we can wander around a little bit. See if we can't find a cue bone, and I'll dig as we go. Um, we would need bones and... Oi! Is daylight? Ink. We need bones and ink. And that comes from... We would need to take out... Oh, God! The, um... I can't believe I'm drawing a, a blank. The, the octopuses drop the ink, the octopus Pokemon, and Cubones drop the ink. Or, I'm sorry. Drop, um... Drop bitch. Um, drop bones. So we would need to find Cubones to get it. So I think we're just, for now, we're just going to use regular old clear glass. Which kind of sucks, but, you know, what can you do? Okay. Come on, show me a Q-bone. Show me a Q-bone. Maybe, we'll, maybe we'll come down here by the river. I wonder if that has anything. Trap inch. Oh my god, that's a green trap inch. Who would probably kick my butt. But it is a boss mob. So. Bingo. Fight. Ice shard. Level 26 trap inch. Ooh, baby! Fight. Ice shard. Kill! Goodbye. Won the battle. And we got an antidote and an orb. Outstanding. 
Well, and for those of you who don't know that the orbs are used for summoning some of the legendary birds, but we, to do that we have to find, um, oh boy, what do we have to find? we got to find one of their shrines, which they should be, some spawned in the world somewhere. Um, I got, obviously, this being that we found villages, I have, uh, structures turned on to spawn, so... some more. Let's bust this shovel up. Let some guys spawn. But yeah, no. Um, so yeah, doing colored glass is a numal. Colored glass, which I really want to do, is going to be painful in certain instances. Green won't be a problem. Um, red, yellow won't be a problem, because I can find flowers for that. Um, black is going to be an issue. Ooh. Oof. Black will be an issue. I mean, there's just caves everywhere. Um, obviously black, gray... Um, blue, not so much. Blue blue won't be too bad. Um, brown, if we can find a jungle, won't be too bad either. Oh, hey. What we got? Friend ball. Cool, that could come in handy later on. Definitely come in handy later on. Oh, hello! An antidote. Outstanding. Now, I don't think Cubone just spawns at night. That could be an issue. Oh, there's one. There's one. Hello, my friend. How are you? You're a Marowak at level 42, which means you are way too big. For what? But we're in the right area then. Because this is the evolved form. At level 42, A, I'm not going to be able to capture it, B, it's going to kick my butt. So we are in the right area then. And there's another one there. Oh, so I'm wondering if they are a nighttime spawn. Hello? Cubone. Okay. Let's. Can we do that? Is that going to work? Yeah, they must be a nighttime spawn, because there's another one right there. Yes! Outstanding! Well, crap! I didn't think that was going to be quite that easy. But that is absolutely outstanding. So now we got a Q-bone. Hey, it um, Lapras? Fight? I shard. We need a good water Pokemon. Which, Lapras isn't bad, but he's more... Really? He used to roll out. Um, Aaron? Oh, let's see, Metal Claw? Thank you. Um, a gold nugget. Level 14, outstanding. Level 15. Okay, good. We're getting some training done. I've got tons of... Um, went back down in that cave and, and just tons of flipping, uh, oh, for crying out loud, coal, so, can do a lot of smelting. Uh, 
Eh, okay. So we got our Cubone, which... Let's check him out. Let's check him out. So... Protection from recoil damage, rock hit, uh, moves. False swipe. He already has false swipe. Awesome. That's the move we want. It's an awesome freaking move. A restrained attack that prevents the target from fainting. The target is left with at least one hit point. So this is part of the catching team. This is part of the catching team. Uh, we need a few other guys to round it out. And Aaron, Aaron's going to be a good guy because he'll be a tank. Um, and if you think we need a decent water Pokemon, Lapras is more, I just like Lapras. Um, but I, I want a different water Pokemon. Um, and I know who I want, and I usually start with, I want to find a Feraligator or a, um, Totodile is what I want. And we need to head over to the swamps for that, I think. Um, outstanding. And what's his stats? His defense is a little low. Oh, he's a mild nature, which isn't great. Ordinary growth. Okay. He's not bad, though. He's not bad. We'll have to get this guy trained up. But with him, we can start really catching him. We also need a Butterfreed or Venom Gnat um, for putting people to sleep, which, which helps immensely. We also should find a, an Abra and keep teleport on it because teleport we can teleport back to our bed, which you know is going to be oh so nice. So let's let's get Sky Armory out here. Um, and head back in this direction. I want to stop by that. We can stop by that. Um, this almost looks like a volcano. There's a Poke Center over here. We can stop by. And I want to grab. Oh, dang it. I didn't bring an axe with me. Uh, I'll do that in a later date then. Graphic, okay. Um, because I can get, I need to get the books out of here. I want to make a uh, uh, do to do to do to do, an enchanting station. We got all these levels, and enchanting is going to be nice and easy. Um for us. It should be pretty pretty simple. Okay, good. So we've got we've got our our Cubone. I'm thinking we need to Ipsy. We've got I'll show you. So the roof is done. Um, partially the walls um, we're going to have windows here. Oh, I need to... I need to get rid of that. But let's... I don't want to sleep. I don't think I want to sleep. Alright. Let's see. Oh, I had my axe on me. What the hell was I thinking? Apparently I wasn't. Okay. Old Nugget's gonna go here. Um, friend ball, these guys, the orb. Anyway, what did I do with... There, that goes there. That and that goes there. I need some more... I need some more sticks, so... So let's go out. Let's go out here. Um and see what we can see with over in the swamp because we need there's a couple more guys we need.
so let's investigate this swamp. This viper, they're not bad neither. So let's come over here and see what we've got to play with. Right now it looks like a lot of zoo bats. Murkrows. Okay. I'm trying to remember what dye these make. Light blue. So we can do light blue dye. Um trying to think if I know they changed some of the spawning mechanics and it'd be interesting to see how ooh murkrow lots of murkrows Lots of Murkrows. And we've got a Drapion, right? Drapion, Wild Drapion. Who else spawns in this biome? Because I don't necessarily want a Murkrow. Murkrow, okay. Hypno. I'm looking for a butterfly, a venom gnat. Oh, you know what? I've seen venom gnats. Oh, a Paris. Oh my god, tons of murkrows. I think I've seen venom gnats over here in the plains, actually. So let's see what we can find. Okay, Venom Nats. As the sun's coming up. Oh, look. Hello. Calm mind. Hmm. I'm not quite sure what that one does. Electrode. Uh oh. Run. Couldn't escape. Uh, run. Couldn't escape. Mm. Okay. Electra blew itself up. So what is this? It's a red tulip. It'll give us red dye. Okay. And we got some gunpowder. Outstanding. And poor Ember took the took the hit for us. I should have sent out Centret because. Those guys have that escape ability. So let's see. Daytime. Because we need a Butterfree or something along those lines that can put people to sleep or stun them. Actually, I think a Paris. And Parasect get those also. Okay. Yama, Yama, right? Yama? Yanma. So maybe we find a Paris somewhere. Which is irritating because we passed a couple of them. Oh, here we go, Venom Nat. Hi! Hello, little guy. Oh, God, you're small, so I might just be able to... Oink. Oop. Excuse me. Oh, get in the ball. Are you refusing? You're refusing. Um, scratch him. Scratch him. Bring him down. Scratch him. Uh oh. Might scratch him. Last one. Okay. Now, bag. 
Pokeballs. Give me an Ultra Ball, baby. Through the Ultra Ball, waiting. And I love the view we're getting right now. Pardon me. Yes, we captured Venonat. Okay, good. And we are in the water. <laughs> okay. So we got a Venomnat. We now have a Cubone. This is the beginnings of an excellent capturing team. So we need to work on training. What on earth? Oh, a Quagsire. Um, an Oddish, too, would have worked. And a Bellsprout. Hey, guys. Oh, I'm also looking for, um, water Pokemon. I need to look up, because I want... I do want a Totodile. I need to look up and see where they spawn. And we will have to go over there and check some stuff out, because... I love me a Totodile. Usually, that's my starter. But I've used that the last, like, five times I've played. Um, and I wanted to play something a little different this time. So we got the, we got the Charmander, who, unfortunately, keeps getting his butt knocked out. So I think this looks pretty good. I like that. We got, we got some stuff we got to do with it. Some stuff i got to finish off. Oh, look, there's all the Lapras. I need to, I need to put some stairs in here, too. Okay, so we've done a little bit more exploring. We now have we've got our first guy in here. Who are we who are we got? Well, let's, let's 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 take Sentry out. We're gonna put Venom that in there. Yeah, and oh yeah, my fireplace. I uh, built me a fireplace. We need to go to the Nether before I can finish it, though, because I do want to put Nether uh, Netherrack in here and stuff like that. But we've got a fireplace. It's working pretty good. I guess we should probably fire up some of this sand. Wonk, and get it cooking. If we're gonna make some glass. I'm going to need a bunch of glass. I don't think I need sand for anything right now, and if I need more, I can always go get more. There we go. Don't, don't, don't. Yeah, we got, we're, we're good on coal for right now, and we're doing pretty good on other things. Found some more diamonds. We can put that away. Where did I put this stuff? Is it over here? No. Um, these guys, oh, there it is. Put that there. Alright, so we got glass cooking. We've caught Venomnat. We're going to need to train him up. There is a red... Oh, God, milk tank. That's a boss. Oh, God, there's no way in hell. Oh, well, let's go for it. Screw it. Let's go for the red milk tank. No guts, no glory. No guts, no glory. Hey there, guy. Um, who we who we gonna hit you with first? Let's let's hit you with. There we go. Um, Swift. Ow. Oh, he's got roll out. Oh, you're freaking kidding me. Yeah, keep let's keep knocking that down. Um Lapras, get Lapras in there. Fight, um, Ice Shard. Ice Shard. Uh, 
Ice shard. Oh, this is going to take forever. He's storing energy? Okay. Ooh! Um, Aaron. Fight. Mm, Metal Claw. Fight Metal Claw. Oh my god. This is going to take forever. Um... Hmm. Venomat's hurt. Let's let's throw Cubone in there. Fight. Headbutt. Eww. Rage. It was that. Um, let's see if we can get Amber fight. <laughs> Amber him. Good, 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 good. That's what I was hoping for. Get him, Amber. Keep going, baby boy. Or baby girl. Sorry. Yes! Whew. Oh. The Sky Army? Wow. Nice. Yeah, we're in level 22, Ember's going to 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Wow. Agility. The user uh, relaxes, tightens his body, moves faster, sharply boots its speed stat. Mmm, yeah. Nope. Take down. Reckless full body charge. Hack for slamming a target also does damage to the user a little bit. Placed by another Pokemon his party. Mm. Um, we'll go with that. Yeah. Dragon Rage. Attack hits target with a shockwave of pure rage. This attack always inflicts 40 hit points of damage. Um, yeah, let's go with there. Scary phase. I don't like scary phase. Uh, yep. What do we got? We got a Dawnstone. We got a mango berry, a leaf stone, a focus sash, and another orb. Outstanding. <gasps> oh, yay! Let's go. Come on. Come on. Charmander's evolving. This is outstanding. Welcome to the party, Charmeleon. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, what an awesome, awesome way to end the episode. That is outstanding. We've got a bunch of new stuff we had. It was a slow battle, but dang it, we managed to beat a red level boss. That is freaking unbelievable. Let's get these guys healed up. Poor Cubone didn't gain any levels out of that. Put this stuff away. And now. Our Ember has evolved into a Charmeleon. Hey, little girl. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, outstanding. Alrighty, folks. This is Sig Corpse. Signing out. <laughs> Bye now.